Hello, everybody. How are we all doing? I want to say it feels like a while, but actually I streamed on Sunday. Which was only a couple of days ago, but that was the charity extra stuff that I'm doing, so I feel like it doesn't count. <laughs> yeah, it's been a while since any regular streams. Work has been a little hectic lately. And also I slept through yesterday, so I didn't quite manage to get a stream now then, when I was hoping to. I miss playing Dicey Dungeons and Prey. I really enjoy those games, and lately I feel like I've not been able to stream them. But hey, here we are. I got Dark Souls 3 in this uh, DLC that I am woefully underleveled for, but frankly beats going back to where I was in the main game. So I think this area had a boss and a mini boss that seemed doable. So I guess that's what I'm working on. Uh, can this thing be poisoned? Why didn't I bring a fire spell? That seems like something that would be useful here. Pretty sure I have one. Oh right, I forgot that she can move. Also, one hit kill me, apparently. What are the controls in this game again? I think there's like a, a roll button. And, I, and can you like attack with your sword? It's something like that. Try casting flamethrower at this thing. Hmm. Is there anything else that would be good? I mean, I think in general, replenishment is a good spell to cast before a fight, but I don't think it's going to be a game changer. for that one. What happened to all my firebombs? I thought I had tons. I guess I'd probably use them all fighting trees. It seems like the sort of thing I'd use firebombs on. You know what? I can probably ditch that since I'm only taking... I don't need poison mist really. Not if I'm going to be using the uh, fire surge spell. A ninja should prepare their gear for the for any upcoming combat. Attack when HP is full. That. might be useful. I mean, considering that this thing one-shots me, there's a pretty good chance that if I beat it, it's going to be without getting hit. Yeah, I think that's what we're going with. Sir, I have no quarrel with you. Jeez, what a crabby fellow. I don't know why 
might pick that up. You're wasting your energy, sir. No matter how many times you strike me down, I'll still claw my way back up. Well, on the plus side, she really didn't like that. On the negative side, my mana lasted about half a second casting that spell. I'd say she really didn't like that. But the entirety of my mana bar did about as much damage as a sword strike, a couple of sword strikes, two sword strikes. Probably not a good investment. Maybe one of the other fire spells is better. Ah. It seemed like it was going so well, too. We almost had her. That one full on body slam can one shot me, so that's the real threat. The other attacks I can maybe just roll through. What are the other fire spells like? Hell Fireball. Powerful giant flame. That sounds promising. If I remember right. Ow. Dang. I thought he'd waste time spinning to get me with his big claw. I thought I remembered that when I hurled firebombs at her, she staggered around on fire and was generally unhappy for a little while. But that didn't seem to happen with the flamethrower spell. So I guess we'll see if it happens with the uh, combustion. to hit. Okay, there we go. That's actually a pretty good return. That's way better than the flamethrower spell was doing. Even if she isn't really... Oh, there she goes. I guess it takes quite a good flame to catch her a light. Yeah, that's more the effect I was looking for. move I don't want to see. Hey, we got her! Nice. Uh... Did we get her? I was expecting some souls for that. Or uh, something. I thought she was like the, uh... Boss of the tree ladies. Expecting souls and an item is what I was expecting. I mean, she certainly had a lot more health than the regular ones do, so she must have been some kind of mini boss for them, right? Yeah, no one gave me souls. What is this about, then? I guess I must have picked up an item from this body at some point. I guess that's meant to be the reward, but it's kind of a rubbish one if you don't even need to beat her to get it. 
Hmm. Hold on. So there always been a ladder up there. Okay, no, this is way too obvious. There is no way that I wouldn't have spotted this ladder before. This ladder is visible because I killed that lady. That's gotta be it. I say visible, maybe it didn't exist before then, but I think Dark Souls 2 had an invisible ladder. Like, if you knew where it was, you could climb it even before you revealed it, but it became revealed after a certain point. that I fought. Or oh, the, the corpse that was underneath the lady that I fought. I see like a figure down there. But there was just another ladder here. Oh, okay. Ooh, a titanite slab. That's... I mean, I haven't gotten like large chunks yet, so I don't really have a use for it, but still that, that feels like quite something. Uh... Stone? That's a uh, curse cure, right? That's good to have. Uh, did you just go inside the wall? I don't think that's supposed to work that way. <laughs> Another ladder, okay. It just goes on forever. Get back here! Well, well. These things are lucky they're at... Oh, apparently they're not immune to fall damage, okay. Hey, a large titanite shard, that's what I need. This... hold on. back here. I'm glad there's another path along there. I'd feel really robbed having circled all the way around. Okay, well I might as well restock my Estus and my magic then. Weapon and spook. Which means I 
I will need my catalyst. Heck you, bitch. Breaks on this side, so you can't climb down. I wish I split in half and for a moment I thought I'd missed something here. But it doesn't seem like I did. Okay then, what's along here? Does it look like new area maybe? Why was that not a back step? I saw the other guy, but I thought I'd be immune to his nonsense because it'd be in the back step animation. the abyss. So these are the arch nemeses of the uh, dark race that I was just fighting. Well that kinda kinda works out doesn't it? Building. Gonna be a finally the Dark Souls skating action that I crave. Been too long since Dark Souls games gave me what I wanted. Is that the graveyard where the uh, where that mini boss wa where that boss was? The guy with the dogs. I was expecting to find him today, but I found something else to amuse me, I guess. I wasn't sure if these were alive or if they were corpses. There's quite a host of them down there. Feels like killing them is going to be mostly a ceremonial matter, but hey. Wedding green blossom. Is 
there's a doorway there, but let's have a scout around here first. So it looks like some of these are a slightly larger kind, more hell. I don't know what the significance of that is. Whether those ones are maybe a threat, but these others don't seem to be. Oh! You appear to be larger still. Really get that looked at. I hear, yeah, I do hear footsteps. It's just one of the regular ones, so. Ow! Maybe that was on me. My hubris! How do I get up there then? Oh, I got probably gotta jump down from that. That's a problem for later then. From above, it looked like through there is a dead end, but I'm betting it's a dead end with some items. Finally, some opponents on my level. I think I'm getting stomped everywhere I go. Okay, what do we got along here? Nothing, this is just the way back up. Those 30 odd people that I just killed didn't need to die. Well, such is life. Definitely can't climb up this. No, I think I've got to jump down from that conspicuous platform above. So the next question is how do I get up there? Whoop! again. Why is this game two-thirds swamp? This is swamp souls. Is that with scissor hands? Wow, I'm not gonna fight you, to be honest. Back to just running through it. But a quick reminder that we have no level to fight anything at all down here. I might be able to fight that guy if I got the drop on him. Doesn't matter how strong he is if he doesn't hit me. I mean, it does because the stronger he is, the more times I have to hit him before I can actually get past, which is... which gives him more opportunities to hit me back, but, you know, it's doable with sufficient skill. That's 
the big one, isn't it? Why didn't I two hand before doing that? Ah well, too late now. Let's try this. Yeah, that's... I'm doing no damage to this guy. Also, I died, and then I suffered from blood loss, so that's the thing. No, we're gonna... We're, uh, we're gonna be running, screaming past this guy. As the gate guards go, I think he's more than adequate at the job of uh, not letting me legitimately progress. He's guarding the, the only entrance and he can kill me pretty much instantly. His very existence is a pretty clear sign that I'm not meant to be going this way yet. A sign I intend to take into account, but not follow. I think she'll drop something good, and she's clearly special out of these lot, but not so far. You know, I should, re I should really be killing those two at the top there, since they drop titanite shards that I really need. Oh well. Excuse me, sir. Uh, that's not the way to go. Thought I could edge around there. I'm not sure which way I go when I go there then. Oh well. Hmm, there's a ledge I could drop to there. Doesn't seem to be anything on it though. That wasn't a backstab. Wait, don't go over the edge. to me that I don't really want to knock them over the edge if I am trying to get titanite shards from their bodies. Not that they have dropped such in any case. don't think I've got any... Actually, I do, I do. I've, I've got that, uh... sword that boosts discovery. I could wear that and maybe get some titanite here. Are you locking onto that? Ah, oh, never mind, it's a joke. Ah, 
Ah, there we go, ladder. Well, I know where I'm going now. And I'm assuming that he can't climb ladders, what with his hands being knives. So if I can get up there, I can escape him. Just have to hope there's not more of him up there. I need to tidy up my inventory. Wait, where's the magic sword? More strength, that's doable. Oh, and it can't be enchanted either. Mm. I feel like I'm gonna get killed here and lose all those souls down there, but what can you do? Yeah, this does a lot less damage than my katana. Both in terms of not matching my stats and not being upgraded, I guess. It's got quite a fast attack, but it seems to go through my, uh... Stamina really quickly. Yeah, I don't think this is a weapon I'm going to make progress with. Not unless I head back home and sink some twinkling into it. Which, to be fair, I'm not currently using the twinkling for anything else. I guess that's a thing I could do. Souls will be gathered on this journey. Can I also can I get a level up out of them as well as I, think I probably can. That is yeah, that's probably a couple of level ups. Ah, it is good, wasn't it? You reinforce this. Oh, it's Titanite scales that he uses, not not a twinkling. What are titanite scales? Oh well. Scales with end, which we've got a decent amount Try of. Try to be careful, I don't want to see my wood. Welcome, her speak. Very well, then top hake now. Um, I guess some strength so that I can one hand this, I don't know. I was boosting faith to try and get that dark blade spell. But the boss I'm stuck on in the main story is a dark boss, so I don't think that the dark blade is going to turn the tide. I'm a little torn because I put a lot of stuff into dexterity thinking that 
my katana would scale better with that, but I think I'm eventually planning to turn it into a dark weapon, at which point it's, I think it scales with Int and Faith. So I should be boosting these two, but except that neither of them are any use to me right now. What is luck effect? Just item discovery? And a little bit of defense? Like everything gives you a little bit of defense. Maybe a little bit of bigger would be nice. Hey, no, Alan. Three to five minutes. Oh, okay. I'm gonna get some HP because for two levels, that's actually a significant amount of hit points. 400 to 450. I think I'm going to notice that change. Uh, well, I should... I'm going to have one run at these guys and see if I can get some titanite off of them. And then I guess I will close up Dark Souls for now. And we'll try running, in, running and screaming into that city next time. I can't enchant this, but I want to try a different spell. I can try and poison mist then. Maybe replenishment before I go after them. to get at least one titanite shard using this sword, otherwise I'm going to feel like upgrading it wasn't worth my time. And also my money, and also my titanite scales. I don't think he saw me. I like how the other guy turned around to look at the poison mist and then went back to what he was doing. See, this is uh, this is fine because like they're breathing fire at me, so it's not unsporting it f of me to poison them, since poison is a fire magic in the Dark Souls universe. He sort of gone off the edge of the cliff there, with the, when the camera jumped suddenly. I thought that was the end of me. But no, I'm, I'm good. Neither of these guys dropped a titanite shard though, so obviously the uh, item dropping properties of this weapon are completely ineffective, and I've wasted invaluable resources by upgrading it. I've been swindled. What a fool I was to try and use a boss weapon in Dark Souls. I forgot that they're all terrible. Oh, 
Okay, well, I'm going to change the game over to Minecraft, and I'll be back with you shortly. <laughs> 